inside this guy's tent. And I think that they're having a, uh, a naked dance party in there. I want to go see, but I'm afraid he's going to see me. Oh, shit, I think he sees me already. Okay, whatever. I mean, hey, hey, hi, I'm just passing through. Yeah, okay. Anyways, welcome back to Mochaccino of Time, Three Heart. Run. Oh, look, they're all back. All our friends. They probably were having a naked dance party, but it's morning now, so I'm not going to bother talking to them. The reason I came here is to talk to this guy. I'm the Wandering Running Man. I've run all over this land. In search of true competitive spirit. Beat all your challengers, man, and beast. Okay, I understand. You're great. You know, you're wonderful. Everybody loves you. You were popular in high school, I understand. Okay, not everyone can be that lucky. Uh, look for a challenger to have a commemorative race against. The best time to go from here to the bridge in the Lost Woods was... 2 minutes and 38 seconds. That's your record. Yes, I will. Oh, okay, he's gonna give me a head start. So now, this is the interesting thing about this game. This is the game is kind of just a bit of a slap in the face because... I need a Pona. It's not a slap in the face because I need a Pona. It's a slap in the face because you can't win this race. I'll just let you know that right now. I'm sure you're probably already aware of that, and if you're not, well, now you know, and it's not that... How'd you get over there? Were you swimming in the river tor that was leading to, likely, Helia Epona? Did you have a nice dip? I actually, I don't... I haven't done this in a very, very, very long time. I cannot even tell you the last time I did this. So, I don't really know what would happen if you beat his record. Oh, dude. Epona. Don't back up. Oh, you, you backed up. The carburetor's backing, backing up. Uh, I don't know what happens if you beat his record, so basically, as he said, you have to make it to the bridge in Kakeriko, or Kokiri Forest. You know, the one where you get the, fer the fairy ocarina from Surya. I mean, it's not hard to get there in 2 minutes and 38 seconds. We ran across the whole world from the bottom of a lake to the top of a mountain in less than 4 minutes. And we're pretty much over halfway there now, so... But again, and again, I said I don't remember like what happens if you beat the time, all I know is that you can't actually beat him. He's gonna be there no matter what. If you somehow glitched your way from that one spot to the other in less than a second, he'll still he'll still beat you. You can't win. And don't believe anybody that tells you otherwise, because you can't win. Uh, the developers have even said that you can't win this race, so... Don't even fucking bother. I mean, well, I'm showing it just because it's me, and it's another one of those things that, if you're, unless you're exploring the... Every nook and every nook's cranny of the entire game, um, you're, you're gonna miss it. And there's a lot of things like that you have to go out of your way to do, such as, you know, the fishing pond. You don't ever have to go there. I haven't even been there yet. I want to do that actually today, because we're pretty much at the end of the game now, and that's one of the big things. Yes, he's already here. Huff, huff, puff, puff. Well, he just said there was only one. Just never mind. Huff, huff, woo! You did it quite well. You did it quite well. But you couldn't beat me. Your time was minute and 34 seconds, but I just beat you by one second. <sighs> you have to challenge me again. So he used the warp. Goodbye, then. Yeah, it's just, it's interesting. It's just weird. Like, why would they put that in the game? It's just, it's, I like it. I like things like that that are just pointless. It's cool. But yeah, he'll always say he, he'll beat you by a second. I know that much, so. And you may, maybe it's just like to have you go in there and be like, well, maybe I can do it. Like, I, I, I'll just do, go one second faster this time. I can know I can make it. And every time, he'll beat you by a second. It'll just keep you going back and forth. and Just to mess with your mind. Oh, you know what we need to do? This whole... You know, I'm thinking maybe this episode will just be, like, a side thing. Because the two, the two big things I wanted to do... Well, three, because that was one of them. Was that... Um, the horse race in the Long Schlong Ranch. Again, I did show you that, but I don't know if... I don't know why it didn't work when I won. Um, and then there's the fishing pond. The only thing I, well, there's two things I want to do in the fishing pond. I want to, hey Luigi, I want to, um, get the Helian Loach, which I don't think I'm going to do, I'll tell you that. Like, I know I said I want to. Oh, and there's Melon, she's so pretty, all grown up. Hey, Melon. Okay, sure. I'll time you for two laps. It's pretty challenging. If you miss jumping a fence in the proper order, you'll fail. Oh, maybe I, m I missed a fence that not last time. But anyways, the other thing I want to do is catch the guy's hat, so. I didn't forget, don't worry. I know I always do, but. Okay, so if I beat the record, she'll give me something nice. <laughs> I'm not gonna. Wah! Okay, I did. <laughs> it's just like you have to do that every time. Da, 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 da. I'm having so much playing. Almost so much fun playing this motherfucking game. Um, so after, oh, I'm kind of sad now, because, like, I just said, like, I'm just thinking about, like, how much fun it is to play this, and, 
I mean, it's not like I can't go play it again later, but it's like... One more lap! Again, you have to be careful with that. You can't use the carrots when that dialogue's up. But, like, the game's over, pretty much. Like, the two big things I want to do are... Oh, this is... Oh, no! No! Oh. Okay, restart the race. Na, 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 na. You failed! You failed to jump over all the fences. Are you making... Oh, I thought you should be like, are you making fun of me? The horse. Her name's Epona. You know that. You named her. Okay, I'll mount Epona. I gotta get these damn shoes off. Okay. Yeah, I just wasn't paying it. I just kept pressing A, mashing the A button. That's my problem. So let's just go ahead and try that again. And I said, like I said, the the big things I want to do are I'm getting out of the way right now. Then it's Ganon's tower, baby, and that's it. It's just like it's, it's sad. I thought for sure she wasn't gonna jump that. I was like, come on, Epona. You don't even need to be moving to jump over that. The only spot you really need carrots is that spot right there. Well, I guess this one too. And you gotta be careful on that one, because it's like, like she said, if you go at an angle, it's not gonna work properly. So. <laughs> if she gets too close, I mean, I'm afraid she's not gonna do it. Don't use a carrot there, use it right here. Then use another one right here. I probably could have skipped that last one, though. Okay, right, we get, we make it. We, we we make it. Yes, we make it. Now just use your carrots. Use your carrots. Gotta get it under 50 seconds. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, thank God, 40 seconds, 49 seconds. That was like a millis less than a millisecond away. I'm sure. Did I beat the record last time? Is that why I didn't get it? You did it. 49 seconds is the new course record. Yeah, because she said it was like a minute and something, right? That was my my thing. I have a, I have to give you a present to commemorate your new record. The present is a little too heavy to give to you here, so I'll have it delivered to your house. Bet you can't wait to see it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Melon. You're so cute. Okay, well, I'm gonna go see what that present is at my house. I'm sure it's probably, like, something really cool, something really awesome. Maybe, like, I don't know. Something cool. Anyways, I'll meet you over there, so hang on. Okay, we're home! I wonder what it was. Maybe she gave us, like, a picture of herself? So we can, like, stare at her while we go to sleep and be all weird and... Is that... Is that my gift? That's my gift. A cow? Well, maybe I'll... A cow? A... What the fuck? A cow. Link's record, spider squish, zero. Largest fish caught, zero pounds. Marathon time, 134. Horse race time, 049. There's 049. Horseback archery, 1420. Yeah, so those are all your records. And yes, it's a cow. Why, why a cow? Well, actually, it's kind of nice if you... Is it going to be there if you're a kid? I don't think so, but... Yeah, so if... You can obviously use it for milk, but that's about it. I still have these goddamn slippers on. Um, I'm going to meet you over at Lake Helia, so hang on a sec. Alright, so here's the fishing pond. Fishing pond. The fish, the fish are really biting today. That's what it says every day. It's written on the sign in ink. So obviously the fish are always biting. And if you don't know how to get over here, well, you got to swim. If the lake is drained, you have to... Well, you're screwed. So anyways, uh, what I'm going to be doing, because um, I don't want, I don't want to be recording for too long at the moment. Oh, off screen, I did go get two fairies. That's why I have two fairies there. Uh, I'm just going to try and catch this guy's hat. Next time, I will do some fishing. It'll be more like a vlog type thing, just fishing. Anyways, who's this guy? Scratching his armpits. Hey, mister, I remember you. Do you? Because we've never met before. It's been a long time. Yeah, you know why? Because you never met before. How many years has it been? Well, we've never met before. Seven years? Well, I... You're my only customer. Well, yeah. Seriously, on top of that, my hair. What about your hair? What's wrong with it? That's a little indication. Well, actually, it's not even an indication. 20 rubies. Jeez, what a rip. Oh, did... I did do this, didn't I? Because I remember skipping through all this. Yeah. Yeah, I understand. It's just been so long, I don't know. So, let's go ahead and... I took off the damn slippers, too. Let's try this. First try. Nope. I'm going to keep trying this until I get it, so hang on. You son of a bitch. Oh yeah, I totally remember doing that. Because I remember catching that fish and then like I ended off the episode being like, Am I going to keep it? And it's, just, it's all stupid. I just don't remember why I came in. Oh yeah, to get the scale. Oh, no, because the scale you get in Zoro's domain. What the hell? I don't know then. I'm losing it. I feel like I'm going to get it this time, but every time I say that... Because it looks like it's like going to go right over his head. Well, it does. Just like everything else. 
And also, I don't, I don't, I didn't mention this, but time does pass in the, uh, in the fishing pond, although it is slowly. And another thing, this, you may think this is the Kakariko Village music, which it is, but it is a little bit different. I think there's, um, different instruments are being played in this version as opposed to the actual village version. It's interesting. I didn't know that until, like, this year. I never really clued in because when you hear it, you're like, okay, you hear it and it's just the same music and you stop paying attention. But yeah. Oh, there we go. Got it. Nice. I was about to give up. Well, not really. What? What are you doing to me? <laughs> he got his hat. <laughs> I, I think you can, like, cast it in there and the fish will bite it and you'll lose it forever. But he's not going to have the hat on anymore the rest of the game. Maybe at the end of the game during... Uh, spoiler. <laughs> you can see it on the hook. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. That's hilarious. Yeah, when he says something about his hair, you might think, well, what's with his hair? And he never says anything about it. That's a little indication that you can take his hat off, but not really, because like, you wouldn't expect to be able to do that, especially in a game this old. Anyways. Hey! What are you doing? I told you not to do that! You're terrible! Seriously! You like my hat? No way. It's mine now. So let's go catch the, catch the fish. You can go in... If you have the iron boots, you can go in and stand on one of the logs in there, which is kind of nice. Um, it's easier to catch fish from there, kind of. Let's see if it, the fish will bite this, though. <laughs> Come on, fishy. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. I just want to catch a fish with this thing. What do you want, Navi? Here, fishy, fishy. Come get a hat. Navi! What the god? What? Navi! You don't want it? Yeah, I probably I wouldn't either. It probably tastes like salsa and blue. Hey, don't run from me. Yeah, it doesn't cast as far either with the, the hat on. Well, let's try one more time. I mean, I, maybe you can't use it to catch fish. I don't know. There's a lot of fish over there. One of them is bound to be able to bite it, so hang on. Dude! No! There's little minnows, but those aren't even those aren't gonna bite. Hey! Yeah, they ain't taking it. So <laughs> Maybe the fishing lure is over here. Wouldn't that be lucky? If I got that like right away. Cause I want that's another thing I forgot that I want to get is the fishing lure. Maybe it's in the wall here. It's, it's only in certain designated spots, but... It's random. I think it's random each time you come in. And you don't, cause you don't keep it once you leave. It's like not an item in your thing. So let's see what he says. Wait, actually, let's try and leave and see what he says. Hey! Hey, you can't take that! Oh, the rod. It's serious. Okay, I thought he was getting mad about his hat. Alright, let's give it back to him. You're a kind-hearted kid. But don't tell anyone about this. Seriously. <laughs> okay, Navi, you need to stop it now. So next time on Three Heart Run of Ocarina of Time, we'll be in here. Yeah, it's, like I said, it's going to be one of those relaxing, just talking videos, so... That all, that's all it will be. Oh, this place is so pretty. I love this place. Anyways, see you guys next time for Ocarina of Time through Right Run. We'll be doing that, and then afterwards, we're going to finish the game. So, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. This is Shenji, and have a good night. Or don't. I mean, it's up to you. I'm not telling you how to live your life.